Your Natchez History Minute is brought to you by Natchez National Historical Park. Located at the end of what today, John A. Quitman Parkway, the Mammoth Drive-In was a popular hangout spot in Natchez during the mid-20th century. Wallace and Sonny Rouse built and operated the malt shop, the drive-in, and where everybody in Natchez ended up. Patrons pulled up, blinked their lights, or lightly honked their horn for service. Wallace Rouse had one rule when it came to hiring staff at the moment. He wanted car hops, not just trade toters. The Rouses were loved by all patrons and employees. The Rouses' car hops were the best in the business, working without pencils and pads, remembering dozens of orders in addition to ices, malts, fries, curly keys. Patron had their selections of three burgers, regular, super, and deluxe. The flat roof at the Mammoth was often used by various musicians who entertained the thongs that gathered there on weekends, including some of Natchez's outstanding college athletes. Perhaps the biggest night at the Mammoth Drive-In was September 12, 1959, when Linda Lee Mead of Natchez was crowned Miss America. Crowds gathered and long lines of cars circled the drive-in all night long. This night celebrating the back-to-back wins of two Mississippians for the Miss America title. Hello, this is Opal Vines. I used to work at the Mammoth Drive-In, and this has been your Natchez History Minute.